development in Linden. I'm Jill Horner. This is Comcast Newsmakers. With me is the mayor of the city of Linden, Mayor Derek Armstead. Thanks for being with us. No problem. Thank you. Let's talk a little bit about some recent groundbreakings. You say these are important for you as a community in a variety of different ways. But let's focus first on Legacy Square. This is bringing in rateables for you as a community. This will be shopping for Linden. Yes, uh, this is the former General Motors property. Uh, as, you, as many of you know, we had been in litigation for quite some time. Uh, but finally, we, we got through the litigation, and uh, we had a groundbreaking. There's going to be a super Walmart built there, uh, and I tell you, the people in, in town are, are ecstatic and, and very excited about it. And this is a Legacy Square project. What's the time frame? Uh, we should have we should be up and running uh, by 2019. I would say August of 2019, the building should be completed. In addition to Legacy Square, let's talk a little bit about what's happening on East St. George Avenue. Uh, this will be apartments with retail below. Uh, the project is called City Village. Give us an idea as to the overall look and feel of this and what will happen with this project. Well, we're going to have 114 uh, what we call luxury apartments, uh, which will be affordable for people in that community to, 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 to be able to uh, live there. Uh, we also are going to have uh, some retail below. Uh, and one of the good things about this project is that the developer is very uh, interested in, in seeing, to it that, seeing to it that his project survives and uh, he's going to be working with qualified uh, residents uh, to help them establish their uh, uh, businesses in, 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 at that location. And uh, this is a, a project, as you mentioned, that will be on East St. George Avenue. Is there a time frame in place at this point? You've had the groundbreaking. We've had the groundbreaking. Uh, by this time next year, uh, we are very hopeful that we'll be able to rent our first apartment. Uh, we're very excited about this project. The residents, the people in the community are very excited. Again, this particular area was uh, economically depressed and, uh, for, for, for over 25 years now. Give us an idea as to what's happening near your train station right now. Well, we've just broke ground uh, with Capodaglia Meridia Phase 2. This is a 145-unit um, high-end apartment uh, complex, again, with retail below. Uh, it's going to, what we feel like, reshape uh, Wood Avenue, that particular area of Wood Avenue. And uh, this is phase two of this project? Yes, the initial phase was 176 units, which is right across the street. Uh, and one of the noticeable differences between this development and the prior one is that we've changed the, uh, the, the architectural design of this building. So uh, it's going to be more aesthetically pleasing as you drive down Wood Avenue. And you say it's important in terms of the location because this is right by your train station. Absolutely. Uh, we've we've uh, had a lot of uh, concern about our train station, so um, we're very excited about having new buildings. And I will be talking to New Jersey Transit very, very soon about having uh, some major improvements done to the train station, which are desperately needed. Thanks so much for being with us. You're welcome. We've been talking with the mayor of the city of Linden, Derek Armstead. I'm Jill Horner.